Hey guys, happy to have you here back with me. We're outside on a beautiful day, really quite, quite gorgeous here. I'm at a, a local park here near where I live and I have wonderful news to share with you all about my, you know, my journey and really uh, excited to have you all uh, kind of supporting me and kind of following me and, uh, you know, sharing in my uh, experience of life. So thank you. So what do I want to talk about? So the news is this, I got selected uh, as a grant recipient, meaning the federal government will be giving me a little bit of cash to do my clinical rotations in psychiatry starting in the fall. Um, so as some of you know, I'm an advanced practice nurse, nursing student in psychiatry. And in order to graduate, I need to have clinical experiences. So I'll be moving to Birmingham uh, in the fall to complete my clinical experiences. I'll be there for one year, approximately. I will be simultaneously completing my psychoanalytic uh, core studies, my second year of studies as a second year candidate there uh, at Emory in Atlanta. Um, I'll be doing that directly through Zoom uh, for now while concurrently doing my clinical and coursework through UAV. So, you know, as all of you might know, I have a huge passion for helping people and understanding how in the world to be a good helper especially a psychotherapist. And to be honest with you guys, I believe pretty, pretty intensely, it's when we start to socialize in the way that our instinctual life has sort of uh, grounded us that we begin to uh, feel so much healthier mentally and physically. And I wanna help people sort of come to this greater understanding through the psychotherapeutic relationship. And my psychopharmacology and medical training will sort of just be uh, adjunctive because I've come to understand that many of our physical health problems, they masquerade insidiously as mental health issues. Meaning, there is a very real uh, allostatic load and a very real, you could say, psychoendocrine immunological uh, feedback-like relationship between thoughts, feelings, and somatic states. So, in order to do what I think of as real healing work, I have to invite in really the physiology of the body and take it very seriously uh, in that therapeutic relationship. So if any of you are curious to know more about that kind of stuff and you're just joining me, please subscribe and like and all that good stuff. And I'm just really grateful and excited to share this wonderful news with you guys. Uh, so to your mental health, to your flourishing and to your relationships. Okay. See you soon. Bye.